Good evening guys, welcome back to the channel, Doc Holiday here. So I know it's been a while since I did any videos of me really kind of talking through my videos. Uh, that will probably be the format going forward, maybe with the exception of a few videos here and there. I've found that I'm actually getting quite a bit more traffic if it's just the video footage without me trying to discuss things, talk about things. Uh, makes the video shorter, seems to attract people. Anyways, I just want to... Uh, I just came here today to do a quick video. Um, I got a new red dot for my pistol. So as you guys know, I've shot the Delta Point Pro on my Canic for quite a while. It's a 2.5 MOA. Uh, I did borrow a buddy's Trigicon SRO 5 MOA dot. Uh, he needed it back. So this last match I shot, that the last video there, it was a complete train wreck. I put my Delta Point Pro back on and I noticed a huge difference. So I did a bit of uh, researching around. Didn't really want to spend the $500, $600 for the Trigicon. So I don't know if you guys realize this or not, but Bull Armory makes one. It's, uh, it's, I just got it here today. So it is actually a 5 MOA. It's supposed to be almost identical to the Trigicon. I know there's not a lot of videos out there on it. So I just thought I'd do a quick uh, video kind of unboxing it, kind of going over it. Uh, keep track of it as uh, the year goes on, see how things go. So I'm really hoping that uh, this will be good. So anyways, guys, this is the uh, Bull Armory um, MS2. It's a 5 MOA dot. So uh, why don't we go ahead and start unboxing this and get right to it. All right, guys, so here it is. Uh, there's the box. And just to give you, so you get it from Shooter's Connection, uh, 289 90 is the price, uh, $15.60, two days air shipping, really good deal. Minus 25 for a discount there. So uh, pretty good deal for a dot, guys. So let's go ahead and get to it here. Uh, like I said, this is the first time on unboxing it. Um, so yeah, so first off, it comes with a nice little box, man. Um, nice little plastic box. So uh, this is what you get cloth um yep the red dots here little rubber cover and so guys as you can see man it's it's pretty close to uh what a trigicon is so uh you know the downside is it's a uh bottom battery not a battery on top but i mean heck for for that price uh, as long as the quality is good and it, it, it works just as well I'm hoping to God it lasts as long, so it's only got a one-year warranty, so it's kind of the downfall. But uh, yeah, guys, I mean, man, check that out. That's that's pretty decent there. So yeah. So anyway, let's go ahead and pull the foam out. See what we get. Uh, clean cloth. Yep. So some screws. Uh, there's a battery wrench, wrenches. Um, see more screws and this is a extra little plate to mount on to um, yeah the uh, Picatinny rail so if you guys wanted to use it on a, a AR style rifle or anything that's got a Picatinny rail uh, you know they do include the plate so that's good um, one thing I did notice that I like is that you know it's got this big rubber seal around the battery compartment so yeah, guys, let's uh, let's go ahead and get this thing all put together. So, I uh, got to get the uh, plates out of my Canic box. All right, all right, we'll figure out which ones go where. All right, guys, so it looks like the uh, number two plate is the RMR plate, or the SRO plate. So, get it on there fits on there i just had it on there so there you go guys yep it's uh not mounted on the plate but it's kind of what we call dry fit so i know it's gonna fit so let me get this plate mounted onto the gun and then i'll go ahead and get the dot mounted on the gun we'll see how it looks on the gun guys hey guys i just want to show you real quick man i absolutely love this gun canic absolutely did it right when they made their plates as you can see, they have the uh, steel thread inserts in there for the screws to bite on for the uh, optics. So 
You don't have to worry about uh, the screw stripping out at all, that's for sure. All right, guys, here it is. There she is, all mounted up, man. Let's see if I can get the dot in here. Yeah, there's a little bit. So, it took a bit uh, of figuring out why it wasn't turning on. Uh, so, the battery they sent me was actually dead. So, that's okay. It takes just the uh, standard CR2032 uh, batteries. So, I had plenty of those. Got the same one that uh, my Delta Point used. So, yeah, guys. I'm looking forward to it, man. So, I will definitely kind of keep you guys posted and see how things go. Um, I hope it holds up. So, I'm pretty excited about this. So, uh, just had to... Uh, you know, it doesn't come with a manual, so I down, went to the website and downloaded the PDF file for the manual. So, I'm um, all good now, but, yep. So, anyways, uh, if you guys are looking for a dot, uh, this might be a good option instead of spending the money for an SRO. Um, so, we'll see. But, uh, alright guys, we'll catch you later, man. Thanks for watching, and I'll, uh, I'll keep you posted.